Hi, this is Hannah with Wonderfully Made, and today we're going to make sushi. Now, the funny thing about sushi is that I used to not like it at all, but my husband kept trying and trying until I started to love it. Now my kids have been asking for sushi for so long, and I have been putting it off because it takes a little while to make, but today I told them we're going to have sushi. So let's get started. First, you want to rinse the rice. Now you can make sticky rice in many, many ways. I decided to use a rice cooker. You want to make sure that the water covers the entire rice. And if you put your finger in, the water should come up to the first line on your finger. That's the Asian style. Now you covered it with a lid. Now you just want to let the rice cook. Meanwhile, we can prepare what goes inside the sushi. We can start by cutting up the cucumber into slices. And then we'll cut them into strips. Next, we can peel our carrot. And like the cucumber, we will cut them first into slices and eventually into strips. So my husband gave me this avocado knife recently and I thought this would be the perfect opportunity to try it out. You use a knife to cut the avocado open, you scoop out the stone, and then you flip the knife around and use the other end to scoop out the yumminess inside. As it was a little messy, I decided to use an ordinary knife. And this is really easy, you just cut the avocado into quarters and then you can so easily peel it. quick lesson on how to get really good avocados. I let mine sit and ripen with the bananas and once they feel soft to touch then I'll put them in the fridge and that's where they stay until I use them. Because the crab sticks were just a little thick I decided to cut them in half. Once the rice is done and warm just open the lid Give it a good stir and then put it back on and let it sit for 10 more minutes. <laughs> Once the rice is done, we can unplug. There it is. So I don't have a rolling mat, so I thought we'll try a baking sheet. You want to put the shiny side down and then cover it with rice. You need about a cup of rice. And then with a wet spoon, you want to press it down Next, we're gonna put the ingredients for the inside on the sushi. So we got some avocado, got some carrot, we got some crab, and some cucumber. Now we're gonna try and roll it. You wanna press down. And then you want to keep rolling, keep pressing down, keep rolling. Okay, let's see what it turned out like. Wow! And here we are.
let's try it. So good worth making. Well, I hope you've enjoyed making sushi with me today. I sure had a blast. I think we'll make sushi more often. Please subscribe for more videos. Hit the bell. I hope we'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day and remember, you are wonderfully made. <laughs> Bye.